Farce of the Penguins is definitely a pet project. This is not a film that has been created with an audience in mind. This is a film that has been created to allow the crew, many of whom have worked before together, to come together and to just create something that I imagine would have actually been a lot of fun to voice and to edit together and I guess to all come together during the the, pre the premieres and things. But as a viewer, it's just really weird and I feel bad saying that I kind of slightly regret watching it because the cast, some of my favourite actors are in this, or voice actors. So this was released in 2006 and it's directed and written by Bob Saget, who I love and I think he's amazing, he's incredible, he's a great comedian, he's a great actor. So I kind of really wanted to really like this, but I just can't, I really cannot like this. The description is as follows. A mockumentary that illuminates penguin survival and mating rituals, as well as one bird's search for love while on a 70 mile trek with his hedonistic buddies. I mean, it, it is what it is. The narrative isn't exactly gripping. The mockument, I mean, I'm not the biggest fan of mockumentaries anyway, so straight away it was never going to be my favourite film. The penguins are interesting to watch. We do have some interesting footage of the penguins. Certainly, it's more comedic than just your average documentary about penguins. Is it educational? I guess to a degree, yes, it is. I don't know that much about penguins other than what I've learned from Mr. Popper's Penguins and Happy Feet. So, I guess I probably did learn some things as I went along without realising it. It's quite... The humour is, I wouldn't say it's crude humour, but it's certainly not child friendly. It's rated R. I, I don't know what that is in the UK. I wouldn't, I'd say it's a 15, but I'm not 100% confident. It's not completely over the top, but at the same time, some of the things the penguins say are just slightly bonkers and quite outrageous. The only thing I did really like about this was the voice cast. The voice cast is absolutely insane. I'm not sure what the budget was. The budget information. <laughs> the worldwide gross at the box office was $6,832. So there you go. You can tell. Um, I expect they paid more to pay the voice actors than they made because the voice actors are incredible. So I'm just gonna run down it. It's narrated by Samuel L. Jackson. We also have Alison Hannigan, Bob Saget voices, Brie Larson, um, Dave Coulier, John Stamos, Jodie Sweeten, Laurie Lachlan. Straight away you can see we have a lot of the cast of Full House doing this. Jason Biggs, Jim Belushi, Whoopi Goldberg, Christina Applegate. I'm just plucking out names that I recognise. There are a lot of other people, a massive voice cast, which is weird. Tracy Morgan and Scott Wenger, who plays Horny Penguin. That's also an uncredited role. Um, penguins do have very uh, bizarre names. We have Hot Penguin, There's No Snow Penguin, What's Global Warming Penguin, He's So Gross Penguin, Melvin Smacking Penguin. That's all bitches penguin. Um, a lot of these are things that the penguins say. So you can tell the level of humour and bluntness in this. Is it worth watching? I don't know. It's an hour and 20 minutes and if you're certainly if you're a fan of Full House I'd say give it a go just to hear these voices in a completely different light and um, if you're just looking for a good film that's funny and interesting it's definitely not fitting the bill but if you're a fan of any of the crew or cast involved then give it a go but don't hold your breath if you are for some reason a big fan of mockumentaries and like crude humor to the point where every other word is basically bizarre you might like it. I'd be really interested to know if anybody does like it because it has 4.1 out of 10 on IMDb across 4,716 reviews, which is not the worst rating ever. Obviously, it's not great, but it's probably higher than I would have rated it. Is it good? No. Is the cast and crew incredible? Yes. Give it a watch if you're interested. Don't expect much. But please do let me know what you think of it because I'm very curious.